I'm Stormwatch meteorologist Alyssa Carsley with a look at your web weather. We definitely had a chilly start to this morning. Remember, we do still have that freeze warning in effect for Nicholas County, as well as that frost advisory still out there for Fayette, Greenbrier, all the way down to Tazewell County in effect from right now up until right around 10 a.m. this morning. However, we still have we do will have a frost advisory in place tonight or late tonight, Wednesday morning around 2 a.m. to 9 a.m. as temperatures once again are going to fall into the 30s right around freezing for tomorrow afternoon for Greenbrier, Mercer, Monroe, Summers, as well as Tazewell County. So that just means that widespread frost is expected, especially as these temperatures just continue to fall and sensitive outdoor plants may be killed if left uncovered. So you definitely want to cover those plants up as temperatures once again will fall to right around freezing for tomorrow's lows. These are today's lows. Look how blue this graphic looks. Very cold and chilly temperatures out there all in the 30s. A cold, oh, 140. Princeton's lucky one there. All the rest of us will definitely need a sweater as well as a light jacket or heavy jacket out for today as well as a scarf. Now, we just all do have that frost advisory in effect right around 10 a.m. this morning. However, going into the afternoon will be sunny and dry and those cold, crisp mornings will continue throughout the rest of the week. But we do have high pressure sitting over top of us. This high pressure came down from Canada. That's why we're getting all those cooler Arctic air as well as that northerly flow moving in, which is helping our temperatures cool down into the 30s for tomorrow morning as well. So we're just going to continue to have that high pressure sit over top of us, top of us with those northerly winds moving in throughout the day today as well as into tomorrow. Now, as you notice, we do have that cold front staying back to the west of us. That is moving closer to us. No, it's not going to bring us cooler temperatures going into the rest of the week. In fact, we'll do the complete opposite. It's going to stay to the north of us, but what, what it will actually do is push the high pressure that was sitting over top of us, which gave temperatures or push temperatures back down to around 30s for this morning. It's going to push that off to the east coast, which will allow southerly winds to move back in once again, which will allow temperatures to warm up into the 60s or upper 60s for today or for this afternoon as well as tomorrow. So your wake up forecast for today, chilly start to this morning, sunny skies going into the afternoon. However, temperatures warming out, warming up that much back up into the upper 50s, lower 60s throughout the area. So another cooler day on the way. However, we'll have lots of sunshine throughout the day. So temperatures will be staying cooler in the 60s and the 50s, but tomorrow morning, once again, a cold and chilly start to this morning. Frost advisory will be placed as we go into tomorrow morning from 2 a.m. to 9 a.m. for Greenbrier, Mercer, Monroe, Summers, as well as Tazewell counties, as you can see. Lewisburg hitting 32 degrees. Another temp possibility of having temperatures right around freezing for tomorrow. That's why we could possibly see that patchy frost for tomorrow morning. See temperatures right around 39 degrees, even lower than that throughout some of the areas. But that sunshine is going to continue to shine through as we head into the next couple of afternoons. Temperatures, though, warming back up to above average for Wednesday as well as Thursday with a high of 69 degrees on Thursday, hitting back up into the 70s as we head into Friday as well as Saturday and Sunday. Your bridge day on Saturday, 73 degrees, sunny and warm overall, but definitely going to have temperatures warming up uh, back up into the 70s going to this weekend, but game changer on Monday, 50% chance of showers, the rain chance moving back in, the temperatures falling back down into the upper 60s.